hey guys and welcome back to another video so in today's video we'll be looking into a uh, pain kind of an application in python using kinder so it is not exactly a pain application which we use in our windows but uh, the uh, layout will be something kind of similar and uh, it will consist of a canvas a pen through which you can draw uh, any letters or whatever you want and it will consist of a slider so with the help of that slider you can change the width of that pen so uh, example it can be an intensity of the pen so if you want to make it bigger like the fonts of uh, words or letters etc so once i show the demonstration it will be a bit clear so this is the code for it it is pretty simple it is just kinter nothing uh, extra or no other uh, external library it is just kinter and we have used color chooser as well so this is also something which you get with kinter so it will be a uh, point where you can select your color through a through an internal uh, app kind of a thing so i'll just show you the demonstration so it will be a bit clear so let's run this file uh, by the way i'm using vs code as an editor you can use uh, any editor of your choice and uh, this is the code and the code will be available in the description and i'll also uh, put down some links in the description about the color chooser and uh, basics of kinter so i already have a series of videos for getting started with kinter to check that out and get back to this once that is done right so let's run this and let's see what's output so as you can see it is pretty simple it consists of a menu layer at the top a section over here is just for the pen with a label pen width and a slider so this is just a slider which will uh, determine the intensity of the pen so uh, initially it is at zero so once i draw something the intensity is uh, like a default width of the pen but as soon as i increase this you will see the width of the intensity or the intensity of that has been increased right so this is the purpose of this slider as you can see let's clear this out right so yeah this is the uh, slider through which you can increase the width of the pen basically and uh, this is the menu layer so what's within that there is a option called brush color and within that you can select the color uh, of the brush so for example right now it is uh, black and if you want to change it to something like a red or uh, okay so this is uh, provided with kinter itself you don't have to code differently for it it is like an inbuilt module within kinter so i'll put some documentation for this specific thing so you will get a better understanding of it right so this is how you can use a color chooser from kinter okay so we have selected selected that color and uh, as you can see the color has been changed right so the brush color can be selected through this okay and you can change the color right and what is back background color right so background color determines the background of this canvas so let's clear this so this layout over here this white background is the canvas uh, where we'll draw or uh, paint something so let's change the background initially it will be at, at default color that is white 
let's change it to something quirky uh, yeah so this is the background you can change the background of the canvas through this option and uh, let's clear this out so colors are done options so option consists of clear canvas and exit right clear canvas is something that will clear out everything from that canvas so whatever you have drawn it will clear out right so this is this is what i'm drawing okay instead of using a rubber and going through the entire canvas like dragging your mouse over here and there this is a better option right let's wipe out the entire thing so let's just change the background and bring it to white so here it is we have changed it to white and uh, it was pretty much this for the menu layout this is clear canvas and this one is exit so you will get out of the application if you click this so this was the entire app you can uh, customize with your own needs and uh, the code for it will be available in the description so let's uh, get to the code part okay so the folder structure is pretty simple just one single pane.py file nothing complicated and uh, this is the code and uh, imp uh, importing the dependencies that is Kinter and uh, the color chooser module within uh, Kinter. So there is a class, there is a main class which will bind each and every component of it that is the background, the brush color, the clear, clearing the canvas and things like that. So this uh, initial part of the code determines the default layout of the uh, entire paint tab, right? So what will be the default color of the brush which is black right uh, whenever you initially uh, start the app and uh, if you see the layout and the brush color it will be black and white right so this is the default color over here and uh, the coordinates uh, which are generally used over here for dragging your mouse to point a to point b in this case it is x and y is initially none or undefined or zero whatever you want to call it as and uh, uh, initially the default value of the pen width is uh, 5 this is an build function which will help you to draw the widgets and like the scaling part how it is actually being scaled and this part is uh, generally determining the motion of the mouse so whenever you click from uh, point A to point B and drag to draw out something this is the part which determines that basically this is uh, something which is uh, used uh, in Kinter for key binding operations like keyboard actions or mouse events yeah um, that was it for this and uh, uh, this, uh, this function determines the uh, coordination of the mouse from point A to point B in order to draw something right so if you um, press the mouse and drag it to point A to point B it will draw out something right this function is for uh, resetting the entire canvas uh, changing the width of the pen then clearing out the canvas uh, then changing the no foreground that is the uh, pen color basically the brush color this is for the background color uh, and this is for the label of pen that is the pen width and the slider you can see over here this basically controls the pen width uh, if you even change it over here like uh, vertical the pen uh, slider will change into a vertical orientation so these are some basic uh, inbuilt stuff used in python like scaling and slider and things like that this is the canvas widget within kinter 
so i'll put this also in the description for a good documentation purpose and uh, yeah this is the menu section this will uh, uh, create a menu for the entire paint app and this is the function which will pretty much run the entire app right if you're familiar with python this will be pretty much uh, run the entire app right so yeah this was it for this entire paint application it is not exactly paint but i'm trying to do something similar to it right so you can add more functionalities functionalities to it like the saving options you can add more widgets to it and some good menu options to it so i just showed you only some basic operations like changing the um, brush color and the background and clearing the entire canvas and some exit option right so based on your ideas you can extend this app and uh, the code will be available in the description so do check that out or do also check the basics tutorial of kinter which i've already created and uh, i'll mention some uh, good articles about uh, choose color within the kinter uh, library and uh, yep uh, this was it for this video guys and uh, thanks for watching